I'm Chocolate Cake, welcome back to Solar 2. The last thing we're going to be doing as a star is becoming a neutron star. Neutron stars are pretty much the same as regular stars, except you can only have four planets no matter what size you are, because there's only one stage as a neutron star. The other thing that's different about neutron stars is that if you lose too much mass, you won't go back to a regular star, you'll just die and respawn. But since there's nothing else to do as a neutron star, we can go ahead and become a black hole right now. As a black hole, you are basically invincible. The only thing that can destroy you is other black holes. But if you get eaten, you'll respawn somewhere close to the amount of mass that you had when you were eaten. You'll see that the next goal is the big crunch. And that happens once you get to one million mass. It might seem a long ways away, but with everything flying towards you, it's pretty easy to gain mass. One of the best ways to gain mass, though, is by eating other black holes. They have at least a hundred thousand mass, depending on their size. And you can easily almost double your mass in just a few seconds if there's another large black hole nearby. You don't want to move too quickly as a black hole, because if you do, everything will just fly by you and you won't have a chance to suck them up. And now, we start life over as an asteroid.
That's all there is to Solar 2. Thank you for joining me.